Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create, and I'm here to share my latest mini album, which is Stamperia, You and Me. It's nine by nine by two and a half. It has four pocket pages inside. As you can see, I did an inset frame for the cover, and I recessed part of it and then I also elevated part of it. These are the filigree pieces that I used. A little bit of silver ribbon and then right here it's hard to tell. I'm going to flex it. That's from the Graphic 45 Square Tag Die which also includes a clock and this beautiful filigree that goes around the clock. And that's what I placed here. And I think these two things just oppose each other and this as well. So I think it's beautiful. This is from the signature page of the scrapbook 12 by 12. In the video, um, I show how to shrink down the frame so that it fits here because this is actually part of the 12 by 12, which is larger than the nine by nine. And I show you how to cut, fussy cut through some of the the pattern and then just bring it together and you can't even you can't it's hardly it's hard to see even I have a hard time finding it so there's a seam right here and one over here right here I can feel it I can feel it but I can't see it there's our spine it's very simple I love this pattern it's so beautiful and so simple perfect for a wedding album so here's the inside cover, which is this gigantic pocket, which is perfect for storing all the really meaningful notes that people leave you, cards, your invitation to the wedding, even your menu. Then right here on the first page, this is supposed to be the other way, sorry about that, we have this beautiful image, opens and we have lots of room for photo, and then up here a little bit of room for journaling. I keep doing that backwards. Okay. And the next page, we have this beautiful image, which is fussy cut from the 12 by 12 scrapbook page. This is a die cut, and this is a die cut up here. Then it oh, sorry, opens and there's a card fold inside. So tons of room for photos here, here and here, as well as here. And then it all goes back inside that pocket. I'm sorry, I had some other things on the side of the table that are interfering. Here is a big giant pocket that's supposed to be filled with yummy goodies. I took out the first time I filmed this and the camera was not rolling. So this is just a simple four inch pocket and you put all your inserts in. My favorite part, which is the center of the album. I love the colors. I added these flowers, which are in the description if you look at the material list. These two ribbons are indicators that you can open it up and there's more photo space. This is just a beautiful, simple page for a perfect photo. And there's an insert here. So the way I designed it, I glued it down on three sides, but if you put a gusset on three sides, you could make a thicker insert, which means you could decorate the front, the back, and also the base. So you could actually have room for three five by five photos. It's not that hard. I don't know why I'm struggling. Oh, I know why. These two ribbon ends are supposed to come up. So the thing that keeps this from sinking all the way down to the bottom are these two ribbon ends. This is glued on the top and these are open on the bottom. This is a one, two tiered pocket page. And this was designed to house this, this, this nice square, which is a cut apart with a die cut on top. 
and this is also a cut apart from the collection. So isn't that beautiful? So it's just two pockets. One's a path through, pass through. So these go all the way to the bottom and then one's a shallow pocket. And then here is page eight. This is a cut apart from the collection and it's double matted. And it opens up to this beautiful page with lots of room for journaling. And then the last, which is the back cover, is another giant pocket for all the bits and pieces that you did not put in the album, which you're saving to use as you decorate the album or their elements that you collect from the wedding itself. So that's it for you and me. I love it. Um, this is just simple silver ribbon. This is a charm that comes if you buy the collections from us as well as these. And this is from the Graphic 45 Square Tag Die Set. So thanks everybody for checking in and I'm <laughs> I'm really enjoying this collection. Nine by nine is a new size for me. So I had some challenges trying to figure out how to use the paper, but um, I think I did an okay job. So I hope you enjoy it. There will be a companion project to this, which will be a 10 by 10 gift box. And that'll be out in a couple of days. Thanks everybody. See you soon.